Forensic specialists in Romania have found the burnt remains of canvas, paint and nails in the oven of a woman whose son has been charged with breaking into a gallery in the Dutch city of Rotterdam. Olga Dugaru's son is amongst three Romanians accused of stealing artworks by masters such as Monet, Matisse and Picasso in October. She had told prosecutors she was scared after realising the seriousness of her son's alleged offence and burnt the paintings in her home. From what I've seen over 25 years of doing these investigations is that these thieves are better thieves than they are businessmen. They don't sit down and think about what they're going to do with the paintings before they steal them. All they do is they put all their effort into stealing the material, but they don't know what they're going to do with them after they get them. The only value in a painting of any type is authenticity, the provenance, and good title. And in these cases, these people do not have good title of these paintings, so therefore they can't get anything for them. This is not the first time this has happened. Um, there's been another situation I remember in the 1990s where uh, a, a man by his name of Stefan Breitweiser, he was from France, had been going to museums, he stole many, many pieces, and, and basically when, uh, when he was being caught, his mother threw those pieces into a canal to try to get rid of them. At this point, they're going to be looking at the forensic evidence that's going to be found in the ashes. Um, uh, they're looking for different uh, uh, elements, trace elements from the paint, uh, they've also found some uh, nails, pieces of nails, that would have been used in the actual uh, stretchers and all the and the portraits as well, as far as that's concerned. So they are looking for those forensic elements that they can find that, that would uh, correspond to the elements that were in the paintings themselves.